Welcome everyone, I would like to show you how to save battery life in your Google Pixel 6a. So the best way to do this is using the battery saver right here. Tap on it to turn it on, turn on again. And what this will do is it will full start mode on, it will slower the processor, and that on its own should do a lot to help with the battery life, but there are some other things you can do as well. So once you have battery saver on, just load up the settings app, and then from here, you're gonna scroll all the way down until you see location, select location, and then you're just going to tap on app location permissions. And if you want to have, let's say some applications here, which are using your location all of the time. So you can see Google can use my location all the time. That is a bit concerning because that's gonna use a lot of battery life, okay? So tap on this app. If you think the app doesn't need to use location all the time, let's just select here, allow while using the app, okay? Or don't allow it. So it did give me a warning message, which is Google saying, uh, give me your data, you know, uh, but you can just turn that one off right here Now another thing as well is Wi-Fi scanning and Bluetooth scanning. So just search up for Wi-Fi Scan and you see a Wi-Fi scanning when you tap into this one here You see Wi-Fi scanning and Bluetooth scan I always turn this one off because what this does is it will constantly search for Wi-Fi networks and Bluetooth networks even if you turn off Wi-Fi and Bluetooth, even if you don't need to. And so this will use unnecessary battery life, okay? Because it's constantly scanning for Bluetooth devices, even when you don't need it. It will constantly scan for the Wi-Fi networks, even when you don't need it. Uh, even if you're already connected to Wi-Fi, it will keep on scanning. And so you can just turn these ones off, boom, turn these ones off, and that will also help save battery life. And honestly, thanks to the battery saver, most of the things you need to worry about are already covered, but those two extra tips help out. If you aren't able to see the battery saver in you know, the control center here, you can find it in the battery area inside the settings. Just turn on the battery saver just like that. And it will also turn off when the battery is charged as well, which is pretty darn cool. So with that being said, thanks for watching. See you guys later. Bye-bye.